Hello everyone, this is Yamin and welcome to Laravel Hotel Management System project tutorial for beginner. So in this tutorial, we are going to let the admin delete the data from the booking table. So uh, here we will have the delete option and we will have the delete button for each booking. So let's go back to our code and uh, we will go to our booking.plate.php and we will go down. And here again is the image table header, we will just copy it, paste it here and we are going to say here delete so right now if we save then refresh there you can see you have the delete column so let's go and have a delete button here so uh after the image td we are going to have another td here we'll say td and inside this td we are going to have a anchor tag then inside this anchor tag we are going to say delete then in this href we are going to uh mention a between uh bootstrap class so it will be btn btn let's say danger save it here then let's refresh and there you go we have the delete button so right now let's go back and in this hf let's get the url we'll give two second bracket then we'll say here url to first bracket to single position let's say delete underscore booking so in order to delete a specific data we also need to get the specific id so here you can see using the dollar data we are showing all the details over here so in order to get the specific id we need to say here dollar data this arrow sign we need to say here id so when you click on this delete button it will get the specific data and go to this url so let's go to our web.php and let me just copy this out, control C. Then we we'll paste it over here. Then it will be route get and our URL name was delete underscore booking. So let me just copy. We'll paste it here. Then we also need to cast the ID. So we we'll give our here to second bracket. We we'll say here ID. And here the function name will be let's say the same thing, delete underscore booking. So let's just save this. So right now let's go to our controller, admin controller and create this function. So uh, here is our admin controller. So here we are going to say public function create underscore booking to first bracket we need to cast the id. So we we'll say here dollar id then to second bracket. So first of all here we need to say declare a variable let's say dollar booking or dollar data let's just say over here dollar tata equal to we need to mention the table model name so our table model name is booking so if we say over here booking to our clone we need to say find to first bracket dollar id so after this we will say here dollar data this arrow sign delete and after deleting data we will uh, return the user to the same place so we we'll say here return redirect to first bracket this arrow sign back so let's just save this and let's go back to our port i mean the browser let's refresh here and here we have uh, four data let's say we want to delete this data so if i now click on delete it's reloading and the data is deleted so when you click on the delete button it will show us a confirmation message that are you sure to delete this so for it let's go back then we we'll go to our bp.blade.php and inside this anchor tag we are going to mention a javascript function so we we'll say here on click then return confirm to first bracket then to single quotation and we are going to say here are you sure to delete this like this and we also need to give a semi-clore over here so let's save it again back to our browser refresh let's uh, click on this on click delete and here you go it is showing us a confirm message that are you sure to delete this if i click cancel click on delete the data and if i now click ok page is loading and the data is deleted so this is all for this tutorial. Uh, so in the next tutorial, uh, here you can see 
status option will let the admin change the booking status over here so thank you very much for watching make sure to subscribe and i hope to see you in the future tutorials